Hi, Ben here from Trout and Fly Fishing, and I'm back with another quick take. Today we're going to be taking a look at the Echo Compact Spay, which is the latest and greatest in spay rods from Echo. A few years ago, Echo decided to revamp their entire spay lineup. They went from kind of clunky, heavy, mixed review type rods to a brand new lineup of crisp, lightweight spay rods. This lineup extends from the small trout spay to this compact spay, all the way up to what they call a full spay, which is gonna be their longer, more traditional type spay rods. We're looking at the compact spay today because this is really gonna be the most popular series for a lot of anglers. It is a spay action as opposed to a switch action, but it's not super long, and it's just gonna fit a lot of steel headers really, really well. In particular, this is the 12 foot eight weight version, which is just gonna be a super popular size across the board. Before we get out and cast it, I wanna walk you through some of the features on this rod. As with most Echo rods, this is a moderately priced rod and the componentry really reflects it. We've got a pretty standard, slightly shortened bottom grip here. It's got a nice flare at the bottom, which I like, because it makes sure that your hand is secure on the rod. Then we've got a pretty standard anodized double up locking reel seat. And that leads to, again, a pretty traditional standard cork grip. This grip is a little bit thicker. It's not too bad, but the cork on it is definitely a step up from cork that we've seen from Echo. It just feels like a little more of a high quality product. Then you're gonna see pretty much the same construction as you'll see on any rod at this price point. Hard chrome snake and stripping guides. Being an overseas rod, they've decided to put alignment dots on it, which again, we like. And it's pretty handsome, but definitely an understated minimalist type rod. Now we're gonna take this on the water and show you how it casts. I really enjoyed casting this compact spay. I think it does everything really well for a Skagit rod, which is exactly what it's designed for. We were casting the Airflow Skagit Scout, and I tried it in a range of grains from 480 to 540. And on Echo's website, they recommend it at 510, and I think that's just about perfect. It's also nice to see that this is one of the first rods that actually gets the grain weight right on the rod itself. So that's pretty cool too, and if you're new to spay, it tells you exactly what you need to get. Again, this rod casts really well across the range of Skagit casts, from a double spay to a peri poke to a snap tee. This rod does it well, and I like the length on that Skagit Scout. Being a shorter spay rod, you really need that shorter length Skagit line to pair it with. Another thing worth talking about on this compact spay is the action. It's definitely a quick rod, but not too quick. I would probably like to see a little bit more bend deep in the rod than I was getting. You know, it would be nice to get a little more feel out of it. But again, at this price point, I think it's gonna be a really tough rod to beat. This Echo Compact Spay retails for $549.99, is available with free shipping from tridentflyfishing.com. If you've got questions about this Echo Spay or any spay rod, give us a call at 888-413-5211 or email us 24-7 at support at tridentflyfishing.com. If you enjoyed this quick take, don't forget to subscribe to our channel because we've got lots of great rod reviews coming up in the very near future. I'm Ben, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.